multiply and simplify if possible. y squared minus 64 over y squared minus 3y minus 40 times y plus 5 over y. Just like the previous problem, we need to factor all of the polynomials that can be factored and then cancel any factors that the top and bottom have in common. If we look at y squared minus 64, that's a difference of squares, so that factors into y plus 8 times y minus 8. In the denominator, y squared minus 3y minus 40 can be unfoiled. We need two numbers that have a product of negative 40 and a sum of negative 3. Those numbers end up being negative 8 and positive 5. So we end up with y minus 8 times y plus 5. And in the other fraction, we have y plus 5 in the numerator. That can't be factored. And then y in the denominator. Now, we're looking for common factors between the top and bottom. We can see that both of them have a y minus 8. So we can cancel out the y minus 8s. We also have a y plus 5 in the bottom and the top that can be canceled. Once we've done that, we're left with just a y plus 8 in the top and a y in the bottom. So our final answer is y plus 8 over y.